happy Wednesday. So as you guys can see, my scenery is a bit different. And that is because we chose to come to Atlanta this week. Honestly, for really no particular reason, but it kind of was at first. So <laughs> at first we decided uh, that we were going to come here. Well, one, of course, we needed to handle some like family business. So that's first and foremost. So we did actually come here for a reason. <laughs> um, and then we decided like, okay, like let's make a fun trip out of this. Like this will be the first time that we'll get to go to Atlanta and like don't have to do anything for the wedding. You know, like this is basically like our first Atlanta trip that we can actually enjoy. So the first plan was to come here and go, um, cause it's also like Valentine's Day week. So the first plan was to come and go to Anita Baker cause Anita Baker was here on Valentine's Day. And we attempted to get tickets <laughs> and uh, literally like checked out and everything. But then like we kept having problems with the website that like we got the tickets from and it kept like bouncing back from the seller. Like it was saying the seller rejected your ticket. Well anyway, come to find out <laughs> my bank rejected the purchase <laughs> and did not notify us. So we missed out on those tickets, which is all good because Lana was literally Anita's first stop. So she literally has still the entire year to tour. Like she'll be in LA in December. So we're like, okay, like we'll just go see her, you know, in another city. So that was Tuesday. Today is Wednesday. And now I'm getting ready to, uh, and then also to yesterday, we mostly just traveled. Um, but today is Wednesday. And now we're getting ready to go get some uh, massages. Uh, we booked us a couple massage. Uh, so we're getting ready for that now. And then like later this week, we're going to, um, Alvin Ailey has a performance this week here. So we're going to go to that, which I think that should be pretty fun. And, and that's actually at the Fox Theater. So it will be nice to go back to our wedding venue, um, you know, since we've been married. And then I've always just wanted to go to an Alvin Ailey performance. So super excited for that. And that definitely worked out with us not going to Anita. So I'm like, okay, super excited to go see Alvin Ailey. But... Yeah, getting ready to go get a massage right now. Uh, we'll probably stop by and see like some family and stuff, run a couple of errands. I don't know y'all, we're really just kind of like living in Atlanta this week. <laughs> like at this point, I don't know, I guess you just missed it and decided why not. So here we are, but I wanted to hop on here and start off the vlog. I'm gonna finish getting ready. So we are late to our appointment and I will check in with y'all later. <laughs> Right, guys so we just got back from our massages and I'm still trying to like finish waking up but wow I definitely needed that I was telling Eli like that was like my first massage that I like actually needed as an adult like normally I would just go and get a massage like just for the heck of it but I'm like my body was actually hurting and like tense and that was exactly what I needed like that was amazing but anyway, <laughs> I'm like, I'm still coming out of like massage land, but we're about to go grab a bite to eat really quick and then I uh, go stop by and see our God baby. And yeah, the day is pretty much kind of gone in Atlanta. It's uh, for basically five o'clock now, which is only two o'clock in LA. So I'm sure we'll probably figure out some other things to do, but yeah massage is definitely a 10 out of 10 definitely need to find a massage spot in LA so I can go back on like a regular basis alright guys we pulled up to our old house we're here this is our first time being back here, obviously since like we moved, and it feels good. You want to walk around it the neighborhood? Looks the exact same. I know. The, uh... They repainted the uh, tops of everything. I miss which, it. Which it actually was like that when I first yeah. moved in. This is These, the original color. color. But yeah. Uh, yeah, we haven't been here since. Literally, it's been a whole year since we moved to LA. Yeah. So almost to the date. Exactly. I miss all of our space. <laughs> we had a whole two bedroom 
for half the price of what we're paying now. <laughs> With storage and everything. God. But I don't miss it to the point where I would come back here. Yeah, no. We've definitely upgraded. Yeah. But this is definitely a, a, a great memory. So many memories happen I here. I know. That's not like, address. dang, I wish we at least had the key so we can go inside and just see. Wow, is nobody in here? I don't think anybody's in here. If you know, you know. <laughs> if you know, you know. Wow. I'm like the best parties, kickbacks. The best. <laughs> the best gathering. Have taken place in yes. that door. <laughs> Everybody know. Literally. Well, if you know, you know. Literally. If you consider yourself a friend, you've, you've been probably there. been to that house. <laughs> <laughs> and you've had a good time. <laughs> and some good food. Right. <laughs> if somebody were to leave and they come back, I would have still been there. I was here for four years. Right, exactly. Yeah. In that this, is true. Uh, particular. And we probably still would have been, well, possibly. Yeah, we probably still would have been here. Maybe. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not. Yeah. They're just like I know, like because we've been in LA and we ain't been here in a minute. It kind of, it kind of you forget about kind of. Yeah, that's true. A couple right. Of things. <laughs> but there were some problems here. Forget about the real experience. There were some. There were there were some days where we would literally wake up in the middle of the night and hear that somebody yes. was fighting outside. Yes. And we would literally somebody like, wake drunk up. knocking at our door. I mean, knocking. Open the door. Exactly. You see them fights. People like, walking people, around with knives and they bonnets and I'm, stuff. People, <laughs> Slashing people's tires, we done yes. seen in this part of my kind of thing. And the crazy part is, this place was not when I first got here. It became like that. I would say around year two, three. Right. Basically, when I got here. Actually, like a year after. Yeah, you got I would here. say too. The first year, honestly, the first year of me living in Atlanta. Period. I was able to have an authentic, real Atlanta experience before COVID and everything hit. Yeah. And then it all went to shambles. <laughs> mailbox it's an exactly. ongoing joke because i would never like pull in or come outside and not exactly. take the mailbox right i don't care if it was five times a day i don't yes. know it just became a habit where i would always yeah and remember we had to stop parking over there at this oh, uh oh yeah because of the ants yes <laughs> Under that tree, the ants oh the here. security guard is still here as well still here. where he at right here in this car <laughs> Hey, how you doing? <laughs> Good to see you. How you been? Yeah, man. Say hello to the vlog. Uh, oh, sorry. Hey. This is our old security guard. He, he was the absolute best. He yes. Place. He held it down. But then it's like, no, it'll be better if I eat this and eat half of it now. That's some good cameras, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I think I got that hole. <laughs> I hope I got that on camera. Wayne is putting on the door. Like only in Atlanta, y'all. <laughs> the true Waffle House experience. <laughs> I thought what she was saying was, you, you listen, I thought what she was saying was, because when I said I wanted to say, she's like, she's like, I'm going to let you think about that. I thought oh. she was saying, like, don't get no steak from here. Ah, no. She I said, well, saying, I thought about it, and I'll have that. Uh-uh, because she had asked if you, want, if you wanted a T-bone or a thing, and then she's like, and then he was like, oh, wait, let my wife go. And then yeah. that's when she's like, yeah, I'm going to listen to Because I, I was, noticed I was ordering before you. Yeah, it's not, exactly. It's, yeah. I knew it was Uh, yeah, no. <laughs> Come on, I'll go closer. I'll go closer. I just want to tell you here. Oh, Wait. Oh, exactly. Oh. You don't really see owls. Exactly. And it's looking at us. Mm -hmm. 
Oh my god, okay, that's scary. You, want me to go? you know they can turn in here all the way around. Yeah, no, thank you. Babe, no. Yeah. I'm gonna come closer. That's a nice, beautiful bird. Yeah, today is our second day in Atlanta. We just checked out of the hotel because uh, we decided to stay in, in a hotel for the first two nights. And then we are going to go to our auntie's house. So that is where we're on our way to now. Today is Thursday. So later tonight, we're going to the Alvin Ailey performance at the Fox, which I am super excited about. I have literally always wanted to go to like one of these shows. One of my favorite movies, fun fact, I guess. <laughs> One of my favorite movies is, um, dang, what is it? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Something new. Um, and it has to not lay them in it. Anyway, uh, so basically in the movie, she's dating this white guy. But anyway, that's besides the point. The movie is <laughs> uh, like a romantic movie. And anyway, she went with her family and basically went to like an Alvin Ailey performance. And she was just like sitting there crying just because it was so beautiful. So anyway, I've always like imagined that moment. And I get it tonight. <laughs> so anyway, uh, yeah, we have that uh, planned later tonight. And then, like I said, we're gonna pretty much really spend most of the day today with the aunties. I am also working today, um, so that's always fun. <laughs> Cause the only thing is like about me working. Now luckily, like we're not extremely busy. Like I knew we would be. Originally I did a request off for this, by the way, just to make this clear and they decided to deny me, but anyway. We're not super busy with work, um, but the only thing about working like when I'm out of town is that because I work LA hours, basically when I'm in Atlanta, I'm in the Eastern time zone. Basically I have to work from 12 to nine, which is annoying because it's the entire day. Uh, but luckily, like I said, we haven't been too busy. So like I've kind of been here and there. Um, and of course, like just still getting my work done. But anyway, just wanted to hop on here and start off the vlog for today. Like I said, today should be pretty chill. And yeah, I will check it with y'all later. I'm like, not you forgetting how to drive in Atlanta. Ah. <laughs> Had us in the middle of the uh, highway trying to figure out where to go. <laughs> this was not the time ah. that I was on that often. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> I was never on Job over here. Right. Um, like Atlantic Station is not right here. Right. And the grill is right there. Exactly. I don't know how you feel for them buttons. Okay, I gotta have time. Getting ready to head out. Thank you, Sue. Slight little fit check. Boy, I fit not look that good today. I know. That's why I said slight. Very something simple, okay? Peacock, so let me long term peacock. Oh, okay. So all of those are on peacock? Um, probably, and then also, like when you want to go to Peacock, just click Peacock right there. That's where you are. Chicago. Those one downstairs don't have that. Where you can mm -mm. hit Netflix and Peacock. Mm -mm. This is a more, this is a more updated. Updated one. Let's see, Amazing Classics. I need to look at that one too. Oh, honey, I'm gonna get rid of uh, Direct TV. What I gotta do now is check and see. Who has the best guy? So we are on our way to uh, the Alvin Ailey performance at the Fox Theater. I did not bring my camera because you can't, you know, bring cameras in. So I will be vlogging on my phone for the night. But I am super excited to, to be seeing the show, one. And then two, I'm excited to be going back to our wedding venue. This will be the first time we've gone back since we got married. So it'll kind of be cool to actually experience it on the other side. But yeah, we should be pulling up here shortly. So, check in with y'all later.
it. Bye, Matsuda. Exactly. I hope not to see it anytime soon. I know, soon. right? Because it has only been exactly. three months. See you when I see you. Okay. Exactly. <laughs> that, was, that was phenomenal. Yes. I think I'll be able to. That was a great show. You know, hey. I would see them again if they can like if they come to uh, LA anytime, anytime soon. Anytime that they're in town yeah. and I'm there, I'm gonna be there. Yeah. Simply because I love the Revelation dance. Yeah. You know, which is Honestly, always the last yeah, one. Yeah, it was the last two acts for me. They always do like the beginning. The first act is like the amateurs and people that just got hired. Yeah, in. the first one was cute. Yeah, it just reminded <laughs> me like Spellman, like yeah. what we used to do with Art of the Dark. Yeah. Which is great dancing. Let's be very clear. Yeah. We did some great dancing there. Exactly. But it wasn't out of Alien. Yeah, now, those it last was more two to acts. the set, the second, the last two acts. Oh, yeah. The last two told stories. Yeah. The first one did too. Yeah. That was so good. I want to dance now. And you know, I used to be uh, I used to be in ballet when I was younger. So really? It's in me. Did yeah. you really? I really did. Hey, I never know that. <laughs> Babe, are you kidding me? Yes. No, I've never known that. Yes. Yep, I did ballet. Nah, I now can't say how long. Because <laughs> I was a little girl. I never know your ass. Yes, I did ballet, basketball. I've always been pretty active. I knew you've been active, but I've never heard you do ba ballet. Yep, yep. There's pictures. I just got to find them. Well, then. But yeah, okay. I think I might get into it. And you that's know? a form of workout, too, dancing. Exactly. So no, like if that's you don't wanna... nothing but like utilizing their core, picking up them people left and right. Them pick, they was picking up them people like they was. They, they was freaking picking up themselves. Like feathers. Like, you know how that, like, they were picking up themselves. Yeah. So, like, almost like pull up stuff. Exactly. There was even a time in the thing where he was like, I know his ass hurt. Because I'm like, I can't do that at the gym. And <laughs> hey, you're doing that. That's what I'm saying. Like, people think, like, dancing is an art. Like, yeah. Dancing. Good show tonight, guys. It was a great we'll show. definitely be back to another Alvin Ailey show. Yeah. guys for the birthday girl and they seen in the last video remember i called you and was like tell her happy birthday oh, yeah i put it in the last video so now that they know it's your birthday but we're out here getting the birthday girl a birthday gift so she's in here shopping right she wants some shoes so trying on some shoes we're gonna see which one she gets <laughs> okay here's the second option we got the blue ones and then we got these she thinks she's probably gonna get these ones, which I think so too. Honestly, I might get these ones for myself. <laughs> exactly, that'd be so cute. You like the Exactly. Come back down here, or when I go down there for to LA for summer. Exactly. We can we can rent. Exactly. When we go out. Yep. Wear them on the beach. <laughs> yeah, she is so excited. She's getting her first chair massage. Do you like it? Yeah. <laughs> it's like this is great. I say, uh, have you said hello to the vlog yet? Yeah. Uh, uh, I think earlier this vlog. Yeah. And at the Exactly. They were shopping okay, with us. Okay, vlog. The reason why my hair looks like this is because, yes, I'm not winning at another <laughs> so, If I look rough, that's why. You don't. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. This is so much. <laughs> Dang, girl, yours look good. I should have got what you got. I'm, I like to dip in, in the thing. Oh, oh my god! You gonna find me a muscle? <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Hopefully, y'all can see the lighting is pretty bright out here. But today is our last day in Atlanta. 
which it has been a great trip. It's always a pleasure coming back to Atlanta. Like it really just feels like home and it just feels good to like be able to come back and like be around family and friends and everything. So definitely a nice trip coming back to Atlanta. Honestly, like I know I wasn't like recording too much <laughs> and really y'all honestly didn't miss too much. Like we really just kind of been here chilling, honestly. Like this has really just been like a casual week of us being here in, a, in Atlanta, honestly. Like we've just been spending time with family, catching up. Atlanta will always be home for us, for sure. And it's just nice being back. Like I'm just grateful that we have the opportunity to be able to like travel back as much as we do. Just because like it does get, I guess like a little lonely in LA. And like you just miss like, you know, driving to your aunt's house or going to hang out with your cousins or you know, just having close access to family but definitely feels good to be back definitely still planning on moving back at some point <laughs> i'm like atlanta would just always be home and yeah we're just gonna hang out it's a very nice day today that's like 60 something so we're just out um at our aunt's house on the patio eating some i got some wings and some fried rice because you can't come to atlanta and not get no wings so i'm about to smash really quick but I will check in with y'all later. All right, good morning guys. Ignore my appearance. It, you know, it's been a late morning. Uh, we just got back uh, to LA last night. Um, we got back at like 11 or so. So today is the day after, it's Sunday the 19th. Um, and I decided I'm going to extend, like continue to vlog in LA because I really don't remember recording that much. I'm recording, I'm yeah. sorry. No, you Good. The only reason is because my belly. That's nice when, when I gain weight, my belly would be out here, so look, it is already short. Yeah, no, that's nice for uh, he's going through his closet. That's nice to for the spring, spring, summer. <laughs> uh, can you uh, either shut the door or just turn it on just to teach, please? Good ideas. Okay, anyway, so uh, yes, we made it back to LA. I decided that like I'm gonna continue to vlog this week. I don't know about the whole week, but at least a couple of days, just because I really don't remember picking up my camera that much in Atlanta. Like, I need to go over the footage. I know that I've captured stuff, but I don't know if it's enough for like a full vlog. So I was like, okay, let me just record, you know, when I get back home. So anyway, back home in LA, and we are up cleaning and like washing and stuff because on our way to Atlanta, we were like honestly rushing and honestly almost missed our flight. Um, so when we came home, like, uh, when we came home, our house basically wasn't clean. I mean, like we're not dirty people, so our house was not just dirty, but like we forgot to make the bed, you know, just little small things to where like you come home and it's like, dang, like we did not clean up before we left. So anyway, so we're going to spend some time to clean, but also today I posted, um, our wedding trailer, which I am super excited about and also very nervous. I need to, I literally just posted it probably like 10 minutes ago, but I need to like make a post basically that it's like out like on socials and stuff. So a little nervous, but very excited. I don't know, y'all, I'm not gonna lie. I have been sitting on this footage for a while just because <laughs> one, I didn't know like how I wanted to put it out or like exactly what I wanted to do with it. Like I knew that I wanted to show, you know, like our wedding and stuff, especially like for those family members and friends, you know, that like weren't able to make it. Um, so like, of course I wanted to put out the footage, but just didn't really know how to like go about it. I'm trying to like hurry up and make a post on like my socials and stuff, like announcing that it's out so I can just kind of like leave my phone off to the side. Like really, honestly, I kind of get this feeling anytime I post like a YouTube video, but like when it's something big, like my engagement or like removing or I don't know, just something that like, it's like intimate and near and dear to me. <laughs> I always get really nervous to post. I really just need to stop watching it because like, I feel like the more I keep watching it, the more I'm like psyching myself out and I'm like, oh my God, like you are basically sharing your wedding with the world. Like this is crazy. <laughs> but like I said, I'm like, it's already out. So go watch it if you haven't yet. But uh, outside of that today, like I said, we're gonna be spending time to like get our lives together. I'm about to wash, I have my clothes here ready to get washed. Um, we need to go to the grocery store. We don't have no waters, y'all. Like, we came home and was just like, how were we living before? Like, what happened? So, today we're gonna take the time to, like, just get everything back in order. 
Um, especially too because like so we traveled to Atlanta this past week and then the weekend before that Eli's parents were in town so we've kind of had like two back-to-back -back weekends of us kind of just like moving so this is kind of like our first I guess week where we're going back to the normal I guess <laughs> and then tomorrow is President's Day so I have off so that should be good because that'll give me some more time to like just really get myself together and really I need to try to look for someone to get my hair done I'm trying to get some braids, so I need to see if anybody's available for tomorrow. <laughs> I'm like, everything is just so last minute over here. I just need to get my life together. But just wanted to have on here and when well, I start off the vlog, but continue the vlog, I guess. And yeah, we'll chat with y'all a little later. All right, guys, so we finally made it out. It is about 5.30, but you know, judge your mama, don't judge us. <laughs> no, I'm joking. But honestly, yeah, we really ain't been doing nothing today. We cleaned a little bit, and then we just got back from the grocery store. We have our wagon here. Literally, first of all, <laughs> nothing but water and drinks. Cause we're here like thirsty. Like I'm not doing that no more. Like we're gonna keep Did water you tell in them the house. We didn't have any water. Yes, when we got I told them when we get back from Atlanta. Basically, our house was a mess. Not a mess, you know, a mess for us. Yeah, my house ain't never been no Exactly, mess. exactly. That's how I'm like, a mess for us. Like, our bed wasn't made. We have no waters, you know. Yeah. Just not the best environment to come home to. So, restocked on the waters. We're about to go drop these off and then figure out something to eat because, like I said, it's 5.30 and we don't feel like cooking no more. So, <laughs> we are going to eat out today. But today would be it, though. Tomorrow I'm off, it's Monday, and I'm gonna go to the grocery store so we can actually have like home cooked meals this week. But you know, first day back from vacay, why not eat out? But anyway, checking with y'all later. We ain't doing nothing, but talk to y'all. All right, hey guys, I am back. I know it's been a couple of days. I got my hair done last night. Um, and yeah, don't really remember like the last thing I vlogged, but want to hop on here really quick and do a Amazon unboxing with y'all really quick because look your girl got packages on packages okay and I wanted to open them and I was like okay like let me open them on camera so that way I can actually like hurry up and enjoy my products and also all of these items will be linked down below in the description box on my Amazon storefront and if you're interested in any of these items you can shop them via my link but jumping into the first item, I already opened it to make sure that like this is an item that I was actually gonna keep, but I did open it. Ugh. And I got a magazine rack here from Amazon. All these items are gonna be from Amazon, but I got this cute little magazine rack because I have been holding on to all of these magazines for honestly years now, really. <laughs> And I'm hoping to like add more magazines to my collection, but I'm like, okay, like I have all of these magazines. What am I going to do with them? So this is a cute little rack to kind of like hold all of our magazines and stuff. I am still trying to figure out the placement of where I want it. Let me show y'all. This is where I had it right now, but this is also still to be determined, <laughs> but hang on. Pretty much I had it over here. So like we have our like little entertainment set and I had it over here. So the height is like perfect because like it's not too big, like it's very low key and can be out the way. So that's why I like it, it is very like nice and slim. But anyway, still debating on if this is where I want to keep it. I don't think this is how I had it before. Y'all see, I still got the tag on there, <laughs> just in case. <laughs> but anyway, it's gonna be here for now until I figure out what to do with it. I tried to like put it over here, but that was kind of like too much, but I was like, I think as of now, I definitely do want to keep it because I'm like, if nothing else, I can at least put it in the bathroom or like maybe in my bedroom or something. And I think it'll still look nice. But magazine rack for the win. Next, I got, let's see. I actually don't know what this is. <laughs> I mean, obviously I know what it is because I bought it, but I don't know what it's in this particular one. So this, oh cool. <laughs> okay, so ordered some more Amazon uh, workout sets because they have been bomb and I'm excited for this one because I don't have one like this yet. So I just got a cream set uh, with like a little v-neck and some biker shorts. So this should be cute. Add in some nice, even though this is looking kind of see-through. I'm gonna have to try that on because I might have to return that and get another color. But some more workout sets for the win. 
Okay, cool. This is a um, duvet kind of cover. So, and we used to have one that like tied and like buttoned up, like it buttoned to close. But basically, every time we went to sleep, it would like unsnap and like unravel. <laughs> so I ordered this one. This one has a zipper. So I'm hoping this one works a little bit better for our comforter set. I actually have a couple more items on the way as well. <laughs> I'm really trying to like get our bedroom in a good space. So a lot of this stuff is going to be like geared towards the bedroom. I did get a couple like kitchen items and just like a couple of knickknacks. But the goal is to get our bedroom pretty much completely furnished. That way I can then move to the patio and then basically our house will be pretty much done. So in this one, I got a throw blanket for our for the bedroom because basically in there we're doing white brown black um and i guess like neutral so this is like a little cute brown throw blanket which let's see so soft. okay perfect color matches perfect oh goody okay this is cute so just a nice little throw blanket that i'm gonna put over our bed kind of as, as like decor um, but also, you know, of course you can like utilize it for actual blanket as well, but that goes for the bedroom Which that came out very nice. All right, so this is another Basket which let me show y'all <laughs> We have one of these in the living room um, And I literally just bought the exact same one in a different color for our bedroom Because we need um, like at night, you know, like I take off like our pillows and blankets that we don't need and as of lately I've just been throwing them on the floor <laughs> But I'm like, let me invest into a nice little basket so that way it's not on the floor and we can just, you know, put it in a nice little decorative basket. So boom, here we go. This is how it looks kind of like coming out the bag. And then let me show y'all basically what it will look like. Here's the one that I got for our um, living room. So this one is white and then like the natural color. I also got another um, like wall holder for our Alexa because we have one out here in the like kitchen area, but I like to plug it on the wall So these are really handy. We have one in the bathroom, but we just needed one out here So I ordered one of those and then also got some candlesticks because I have not been able to find these in person for whatever reason And I got these like little candlesticks from the dollar store and they kind of just been sitting here empty so I am going to put some of these on there. All right, and the last item, which I'm most excited for. <laughs> this personal blender. And y'all, this is so cute because it goes perfectly with our kitchen. Like it's like a cream, like off-white. So I like, like smoothies and stuff. So I was like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and get a blender. And this one is cute. It comes with two personal like cups. So we have one here. Another here, which we're at the top to go. Boom. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, and it came with like a little thing for ice. <laughs> and boom, here is the blender itself. And I'm like, this is not cute, like y'all. Boom. Even though I'm actually probably gonna end up putting it on this other countertop here because uh, I would like to get a coffee pot and put it pretty much right there in like that little empty space. Y'all can't really see, but it's a little empty, empty space over there and I'm gonna put a coffee pot there. And then this is nice and small and petite. Boom. So I'll probably put this on the other side of our countertop. But yeah, that is all of uh, the items I ordered from Amazon that are currently here. But I wanted to hurry up and quickly open them so I can put everything up and share them with y'all. But again, if y'all are interested in any of these items, check the link down below in my description box. They will all be on my Amazon storefront. And then I'll actually probably show y'all like how I like place everything, install everything, and just kind of like put everything together. But yeah, now let me clean up my mess. <laughs>
so soon, so soon currently here getting our COVID test because we are going to the NAACP Image Awards on Saturday and they require you to get a COVID test. So luckily um, we were able to find a location literally right here by the house. We could have honestly walked, but LA is being very weird today. It started hailing and raining for like five minutes, basically our entire drive here. And now it's just like regular. Hang on y'all, he's coming with our test. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi, Kiana. Hi, how are Can you? Can you lower the window? <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Perfect. Oh, that's staying. <laughs> and just like that, <laughs> it was pretty easy. Uh, they're going to send our COVID test or like our results directly to um, like the people that are over the image awards. So that pretty much helps out um, and we really don't have too much to do. Eli's gonna go next and yeah, we will see y'all at the Image Awards or I guess next time I sign on here, but yeah. All right, go ahead, babe, it's you. You want me to do it or do you want to do it? You can do it. Okay, all right. Wait, wait, how high are you gonna put it? So it's, it's <laughs> all the way up here. Huh? Okay, I'll make it. on this side uh -huh. and that is all thank you so all much all right thank you How's it going? thank you <laughs> i guess that's it huh yeah and that's right it. that's all she wrote thanks same day ho <laughs> <laughs> Thank you to the to the to the NAACP for this uh, for this honor and for having nights like this where we get to be amongst um, our community of artists. Big thanks to all of the filmmakers. Serena Williams. 